The area I'm more concerned with, or most concerned with, is actually <laughs> in here at the base of his tail. You see, the problem is I still have a large open area inside there. And it's quite a sharp bend here, so I actually would like to somehow fillet this. And so what I'm going to end up doing is, let's put a surface in here. And to do that, I'm going to come over on my surfaces toolbar. There's boundary surface, filled, planar. And even though it is on one plane, I think what I'll go with is a filled surface. And my patch boundary, I'd like to go from here to here to here. And notice on my patch boundary, it's putting in edge, edge, edge. And let's try it. Boundary is open and cannot be patched. It wasn't the last time. Okay, well, let's try it. Fix up boundary. And it worked. So now we have a little flat boundary surface inside there. And now the hard part. Fillets. This doesn't exactly look like an organic surface here. It doesn't blend very well, so we're going to try and fillet this area. So I'm going to come over to my fillet command. I'm going to start off with a very small fillet. I'm going to try, uh, let's start with 20 thousandths. And then I'm going to grab this edge and see what happens. There. Ooh, laminar edges cannot be filleted. So what that means is I'm a little ahead of myself on my filleting. I need to knit all these surfaces together so it thinks it's one large surface. So if I click Knit Surface, come out here and grab each of these surfaces. It will knit them together. Now it thinks this is one large surface. So now it should be able to fill it. So let's try fill it again here. I'm open up fill it. I'm going to try a 50 thousandths fill it in this area and see if that's going to work. Now a few things that might help is if I click on multi radius fill it, sometimes that helps. Uh, and sometimes just putting in a smaller fillet works. So let's try 30 thousandths. Okay, 30 thousandths looks like it's going to work. Let's try 40 thousandths. Uh, 40 thousandths doesn't seem like it's going to work. So let's try 35. Nope. How about 32? All right. That way at least I can get a 16th inch ball end mill in there. That's rounding out a little bit. Let's try another fillet. On this upper edge. And it actually liked that. If I give it uh, 40 thousandths. Still liked it. 50 thousandths. Still good. 60. It's going well. So far, so good. Now, just because you get a preview of it doesn't mean it's actually going to happen. So, because it's going so well right now, I'm going to actually try and agree to this. And it worked. 
smooth off that little trouble area we have there. Let's go and edit that and see what happens to it. 90 thousandths, 100 thousandths, how about an eighth? Sometimes it works out so well, and sometimes you fight it and fight it and fight it. Nice small fillet. What to fill it? Let's try this edge. And it's not giving me any preview of it, so let's try multi-radius fillet. Sometimes that helps. Let's try grabbing this extra edge up here. Sometimes that helps. Sometimes you just bounce your head off your keyboard too. What I really want, start with a nice small fillet. What I really want to fill it is this part right here. So if I grab that and agree to this, what happens? It did it. I'll go back and see how large I can increase that fillet. Uh, I'm going to try 50 thousandths and see if that works. And I have to click down here for it to give me a preview sometimes. Also sometimes I have to grab additional edges. Nope. Alright, this is another attempt at this same cat. And what I've been able to do here using no difference in technique. <laughs> I just grab that edge. Here, I'll delete it and show you. My edge, to me, does not look that different. And when I come out here and grab this edge, it likes it, and now it won't do it. Edge one. Delete. I'm going to come and grab this edge here. Okay, so I grabbed in a slightly different spot and now it actually liked it. And it liked it enough that I can even increase this to, uh, well, let's try 90 thousandths. Okay, I'm going to push my luck and say, okay, how about an eighth of an inch? Too far. How about uh, 100 thousandths? And it's giving me a preview and would actually do it. This will round off this area quite nicely. So that rounded that off. And that may even be enough. Um, but I can actually get in here and round again. Uh, let's say point oh fifty thousandths. I can round that area some more, and 
I think that's enough rounding in that particular place. Uh, I've got it smoothed out where I want it. It's not a sharp, steep wall there anymore. It, it's nicely rounded, looks much more organic, and I've achieved what I want to do there.